what's up i'm priska and welcome to my youtube channel where the vibe is always right happy friday vibers mm. i hope you have lots and lots of plan for the weekend i hope you're being safe i'm not just talking about corona be safe all the way around but anyways i'm really really excited because well excited and sad at the same time sad my mom was supposed to be here but unfortunately she couldn't make it but hmm, she sent me a package which i'm really excited to open up there's like lots and lots of stuff she sent from back in st lucia most of the things is locally made and can only be found sometimes in st lucia you know i live all the way in colorado so there's no west indian market i could just walk in in colorado and get some some of those food Okay guys, I'm back and here is the package. Lots and lots of goodies from back home. Thank you, mommy, if you're watching this video. Thank you, I'm sorry you could not be there right now. I'm still working on that. But you know what? Thank you for that piece of home. Okay, so the first thing I have she sent for me was uh, Bailey's. I know, right? What do I do with Bailey's? But what you don't know about bay leaves is that you can make the most amazing tea. When you mix bay leaf, fresh bay leaf, and uh, cinnamon, it comes up to the most amazing tea. You gotta try it. So my mom picked my bay leaves. That's why I like her scent for me. When you go to the store, they're very expensive. And I drink a lot of tea. So no, I'm not gonna buy bay leaves from the store to make tea. My mommy picked a lot of bay leaves for me, so I'm very grateful. Not only can you make tea with bay leaves, but um, you could also put it in your food. I like to put it in spaghetti. <laughs> Alright, so here's the bay leaves for you, right there. Uh, ooh, let's see. Next, we got uh, coconut tablets. Coconut tablets was my favorite garden sandwich. I actually love to see them make it, but I never learned how to make it. So my mommy, it's pretty much coconut and sugar and don't know. Coconut sugar, they make it into a confetti. It is to die for. Talking about healthy and unhealthy mixture. Coconut and sugar, but the best mixture. So there it is. Uh, this is what it looks like. It's just coconut coated in sugar and nice sauce. So I cannot wait to eat this as soon as, you know what? As soon as I'm done unpacking this box, I'm gonna go off camera. I'm gonna have a blast with my treats, mommy. Okay, so this are the, uh, the coconut tablet. I have no idea. I think my grandma made those for me. Thank you, mom. And there we go, cocoa stick. I don't know if you ever heard about cocoa stick, but it is the best, the best. Mm, I love, I love it. It is organic, it's no added sugar. So, this is what I usually drink, mommy. Next week, my replacement for cocoa. When I run out of cocoa tea, this is my replacement. I use uh, next week, or I use a. Uh, this one, I can't really pronounce it, but I do love, I love drinking it. So thank you, mommy. I can make some dumplings and cocoa tea, some bakes and cocoa tea. Oh, mommy, 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 mommy. Thank you so much for that. <laughs> uh, we have gooseberry jam. I don't know. It's gooseberries. Uh, is a, a fruit? Oh, a fruit, I believe. Some kind of fruit growing on the tree. It looks tiny. It, it resembles almost like a raspberry, but tinier. But it's usually sour. I never tasted a sweet one. It's usually sour, but the jam is amazing. Thank you, mommy, for the gooseberry jam again. I kind of keep saying thank you, right, for everything. Because, you know, I missed it, and it's so long I had it. You know, you hear the say, you never miss the water. You never miss the water till the well went dry. Well, that's for me. All this food I used to like, oh my god, I don't like in St. Lucia. Oh, I don't want to eat this right now. I want to eat this food. Now that I cannot get it, I miss it. I miss my goddamn food. <laughs> All right. Ugh. Next, 
Next we have Florina. Can you see it? Ah, Farina, Farina. Farina is made from cassava or I think, uh, what's it called? The yuca. Mm. You can make your porridge, eat it with milk. You can mix your avocado in it. There is so much stuff you can do with Farina. Delicious. Multi purpose. Oh, the baby right there. So let me tell you about this. This amazing thing is called tummy balls. Pretty much tamarind and sugar and sometimes spice to use, depending on who making it, they make it differently. But I also like to eat it with hot sauce, it's good. <laughs> but I haven't had a tummy ball, I'm talking about in years, 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 not long, about a year, about a year and a half since Corona hit, I haven't had a tummy ball, so. This is good. Sour? Worth it. Make sure when you eat tummy balls, make sure to spit the seeds out. <laughs> Alright, let's see what's next from Mama. We have uh, Tamarind jam. Oh my god, I didn't even ask this on my list. Oh my god, I haven't had tamarind jam in over 10 years and forgot about tamarind jam. But uh, yeah, tamarind jam. Here's a picture of the tamarind. I don't know if you can see it. There we go. That's what the fruit look like. That's what the fruit look like. So, this is what they make tamarind jam out of. That I cannot wait to taste. It's been over, never 10, over 14 years since I had this. So, excited to eat the tamarind jam. Okay, next, we have Lalabad. I have, I can, ex I really cannot explain to you what Lalabad is, but all I can tell you, I love Lalabad. Um, this one is from uh, Vera's Laba. Uh, if you know who she is, please support her and buy her Laba because um, hi, Ve what's it, Vera's? Hi, Vera, I'm Prisco all the way from Colorado and I love your Laba. Keep doing a good job. Uh, let's see if we can get it in there. So this is Vera's Laba. Uh, Beck so Castries St. Lucia. Please support her business because this is good. This is so good. <laughs> All right, let's see what next we have. Um, huh. My mom told me what's his name, you know. Not curry, turmeric. She sent me some good old turmeric. Turmeric is also, uh, I think, good for inflammation and makes your food taste good, you know what I mean? Curry up my uh, chicken, add some turmeric. Curry up my rice, add some turmeric. I love turmeric. So thank you. Thank you, mommy. Um, this will cost me an arm and leg if I buy that big up here. Turmeric. So thank you. It's organic. It's pure. I love it. Thank you. Okay. Let's see what we have. Some more cocoa stick. My mother sent me cocoa stick to last me a, to last me a lifetime. I love a little cocoa tea. <laughs> what else? Um, my fixio. Was was it force frog? I love that. When I get colds, I have pains. I use this, so it, it works for me. Uh, this is very good. I have no idea where in San Lucia she bought it, but this is worth the money for sure. We have more cassava. Well, not ca uh, foreign, but cassava foreign. Ooh, ooh, and this is cinnamon sticks. Oh, lots and lots and lots of cinnamon stick, mommy. Ooh, woo. she got me, man. I love to make my tea, so I will mix cinnamon stick 
and bay leaf together and boil them. When you're done, you strain it, sweeten it with either sugar or um, honey. And that's the most amazing thing in the world. <laughs> All right, let's see anything else. She sent me a package of nutmeg, but it can't be bust in the box. So I don't know if you can see it. I love fresh spices in my food and in my baking. It just gives an extra kick. You know what I mean? Okay, so here we go. Lots and lots of nutmeg. Oh, I love the smell of nutmeg. Fresh nutmeg. <laughs> it smells good, right? <laughs> and we got one more thing. Okay, so... My favorite thing out of the bunch. I was praying to God, please let her send me this one. Please. Guava cheese. I can't really explain how they make guava cheese, but I love it. <laughs> it's not an, actually a cheese. It's very sweet. It's delicious. You can eat it. You can eat it if your bread. I love it with my guava cheese in my bread. Or you just eat it how it is. So guava cheese. Try it out somewhere in St. Lucia. Everywhere in St. Lucia could find it. Please try it out. If you never heard what guava cheese is, Google it. You never know. You might like it. So try it out. So, this is pretty much what my mom sent me. Oh, one more thing. I almost forgot. I almost forgot. She sent me a bracelet. She sent actually one for each of us. My husband and my kids had our name customized. I actually love the bracelet because I can't just walk into the store. I don't have a common name. So I can't just walk into the store and then see my name on a keychain or anything. This is what a close up word looks like. By the way, it says Briska. So this is all what my mom sent me. Thank you for tuning in and sitting with me to figure out what did my mom actually send me. So I love everything for everybody who helped put at the box who made my uh, who made the lullaby, the guava cheese, the cocoa stick, and everything is locally and handmade. You know, well the spices for so picking them up uh, and drying them off and cleaning that for me. Thank you so much. If you like, if any, if you like anything you see in there, please uh, comment. I'll tell you what it is and where you might be able to find it. If not, please share the video.